So, I I had the most confusing day of my life yesterday, and I don't know how to process this quite yet, because, like, to be honest, I don't know what the fuck happened, and it was, I, I don't know how to accept this into my life, but I guess I have to now. But anyways, so yesterday I was hanging out with my homie and we were going to a park. We were having a lovely time, blah, 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 holding hands, all the good stuff the homies do, you know? And we were like, let's pull up to McDonald's because fuck it. We want some nuggies because we're a high as fuck and we want some nuggies because obviously the McDonald's nuggies hit different when you're high. So we were just figuring out how to order on the mobile app while blasted out of our mind and pretending like that nothing's happening. And I see this old man just walk into the, the, the McDonald's, and he looks so wholesome. And I waved to him. I'm like, what's up, old man? Because he waves at me. He, I forgot to mention that. But he waves first. So then I see this old man waving at me, and he's all wholesome. He's like, hello. And I'm like, hello, old man. How are you doing today? How, how are you? And then he just sits down, you know? I go about my day, and then he gets up. He's in the back corner, and I'm in this corner. He gets up and then gets closer to me and then sits down and then just starts writing something. I'm like, whatever. You know, I'm just on my phone, you know, and I'm falling asleep because my, my friend has something important to figure out. So she's on her phone just doing her little thing, you know. I don't know what was happening, but I was falling asleep. And then I, 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 I was going like, blah, 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 blah. You know, that, like that one of those things where you like drift off to sleep and then you wake up and you're like, I'm awake, I'm awake. You know, it was that, you know, and... So I was drifting off, and then I woke up to the old man just walking to me. He just seemed slowly approaching me. And I was like, oh, oh, I want to talk to the homie. Well, that's what's up. And then he just drops a note on my desk. Just just this, this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you a picture in post. But he just drops this on my desk. And I'm confused. And, it, and then I look at it. And it's me and the, the girl. And it was so wholesome until I realized he drew me thinking about another girl. <laughs> and then the girl's like, oh my God, she's thinking about, he, they were thinking about another girl in the photo. So I, I, the old man just came up, dropped the thing and was like, yo, by the way, this person's thinking about another girl right now. And then the girl and I were just confused and we were like, you know what? That's how it be sometimes. But we thought it was cute. We thought it was a cute note. So we were like, all right, let's draw the old homie a, a, a note. You know? So we got our sketchbook and we started a drawing and we got, drew a, a picture of him and we passed it to him. And then he went, very good. And then I was like, thank you. And then I was like, no, nah, she did all that because I don't really know how to draw. So I forced her to do it because she was the artist, you know? And he was like, very good. And then I was like, yeah, that's so wholesome. And this entire time. This entire time we were at the McDonald's talking to this old man and drawing pictures of each other like cute little buddies, cops were just pulling up, pulling up. So then he starts drawing again. And then eventually he gets up and passes me this note. This note right here. And I I was looking at it and I was like, that's that's so cool. And I was just looking at it going like, yeah, this is so wholesome. We're, we're exchanging notes with our buddy. We're drawing each other. We're having a great time. And then she was like, all right, it's your time to draw. And the old man gets up. He points at the window. And he points at all the police that are coming in. And there's like three cars. And eventually, this dude with a black suit. I don't know if it's because I've been watching too much Supernatural. But this dude with a black suit pulls up. And he just starts grilling the police, like talking to them. And I'm like, oh my god, are the feds here? And then while this dude with the black suit just pulls up, the police just, this, this, this white guy that just looks like Mac Miller, but like less cool, it just gets pinned down to the fucking car, just gets strapped down to the car and handcuffed aggressively while this dude is just like talking to them. And then she's like, is that the lawyer? And I'm like, I don't know. So then he starts pointing. The old man starts pointing. And I was like, yeah, cops. And he goes, mm-hmm. And I go, do you know what happened? And he just, without hesitation, just goes like this. I don't know if you could see. He goes like. And I, I'm just, I'm just confused. I'm just confused, you know? And then I'm like, what the fuck does that mean? And the old man just keeps doing that motion over and over again. So I, I start getting guesses. I'm like. What the fuck's happening? And eventually, after like five minutes of guessing, I'm like, did someone get shot? And he just goes. 
And I'm like, oh, okay. Then I look over. And like, the, the, the police are going fucking crazy. And the old man just stands up. The police are like starting to come to the McDonald's. The old man just says, goodbye. And then just leaves immediately as soon as the police walk into the McDonald's. And I was so confused. And there's not much more to this story, but it's just so confusing. Because like, I thought about it. And like, he looks so trustworthy and happy and stuff. But he told me someone got shot, and apparently someone did get shot. And while he told me someone got shot, he was making like this motion with a smile. He's like, now I, I, don't, I don't really know how to comprehend what that happened, but my best guess, my best guess, then my best educated guess here is that obviously what has to have happened is the old man got away with the murder, pinned on Mac Miller, and then left. Because that's kind of what makes sense to me, I think. I'm, I'm not entirely sure. I'm still processing what happened, if I'm being honest with you. So I, I, I'm not certain. But that's my guess guess. And that's why I think today has been confusing. And I've just been looking at these two, these two notes that he passed me. And I've just been thinking about them. And I don't really know what to think about this. So, yeah. I guess that's it. Like, comment, subscribe, or whatever.